Let's go to sizing. When all the conductors in an outlet box are the same size, table 31416A of the NEC can be used. It's kind of like Annex E, isn't it? Well, then maybe they should just make this an Annex. Uh, let's, <coughs> let's don't give them that idea. So let's go to this table here. So if they're all 12s, let's go with a 4 by 1.5 inch deep square box. And let's go with 12 gauge wire. How many can you fit in there? Nine. You can fit nine. And that's how this table would work. It's just that simple, right? Steve, we don't have to do any calculations. Nope. Just go there. <clears throat> Number of conductors permitted. So you can find out how many conductors you can permit. Like I just said, how many can you fit in that box? Or the outlet box required. Let's say I had 14. Well, I c and I can't use an inch and a half. I can't use two and an eighth. I guess I'd go to 4 11 sixteenths. Like two and an eighth. Wow. I'd have to go to two and an eighth. Now, 4 11 sixteenths box. Some of you, a lot of people are not familiar with that. It's, it's not four inches by four inches. It's 4 and 11 sixteenths inches by 4 and 11 sixteenths inches, which require a plate or a cover plate, rather, or, or a, a plaster ring that's going to be designed for 11 sixteenths. So it's a little larger box, a little larger volume. And uh, I think I'd use a lot more of those than maybe some people would be using. Table 4, 314.16a. Using the table, what depth is required for a four inch square outlet box containing three 12s and three t 12 TWs and six 12 THHNs? So that's three, that's nine 12s. Nine 12s. It would be inch and a half deep box, right? The key here to the question, yes, and the John? insulation didn't matter. Exactly. You're saying it doesn't matter what insulated conductors you have. It's just simply you had 12 gauge wire. It could have been bare. We don't really care. And here is that example. Three 12s and three 12s is nine 12s. Table 31416A would say an inch and a half, four squared by one and a half inch deep box would be sufficient for that. How many 14s can be installed in a four square by inch and a half deep? 14s, 14s, inch and a half deep. Here again, a ruler. Am I right? It's 10? It is. Yes. Uh, right? Inch and a half a deep. deep round. round box, up one. Oh, gosh. A deep round box. <laughs> what kind of baloney is that? Well, you know, fine. The answer is 10. Well, Eric, just, along those lines, lines, you guys are all snickering at me. Go ahead. No, Eric. okay, no. Bring, I, I teach college class and I give I give tests. One of the tests, one of the test questions is, um, what color tape can be used to re-identify a grounded conductor? Green. About half the class answers that come back are green. Yeah. Because they don't read the question. Yeah. The question is grounded, which is neutral. So. Yeah, just bring, you just bring up a really good point that you have to read the you question. you got to slow down. I, I just saw what? Deep. Four square by inch and a half deep. Doesn't right? even say square. <laughs> well, I know. It's I know. <laughs> well, I say it because it's square right there. You, I know. You said you just saw it. <laughs> yeah, yeah. So my mind is a four square by inch and a half deep Get it again. box. <laughs> that little word round on the edge there. Got to slow it down. You can see this. But I want to tell you one thing. When I take my test, I never scored less than a 96. So I, I, when it... When I compete in competitive world comp competition or national competition, I'm ready to go. I'm focused. I can make mistakes anywhere else. But when it comes time, I'm zeroed in. I would never make those mistakes taking a test, ever. And that's what you have to do. You get a lot of practice, all these other things. But when it comes time to do the work that you're doing, you need to be totally focused. No distractions. Nobody bothering you. You need to get it in there. All right. So this one was a round box. Got it. Round. And the question was for the, how many of them? Ten. One and a half. Huh. All right, fine. Seven. 